Hello, YouTube lovers. This is Patrick. I'm ready to show my third and hopefully final thing of Ken Gary Jr. Hall of Famers. This is a good one. This one right here. Lousy card, a lousy set. That's a good card with KJ and Barry Bonds. Now, if you see a little white on there, that's because that's... I was, I, was trying, I was trying to get that um, stickers off and didn't do that good. Some of them came out a lot better. So if you see like that one right there, see them ignore them, because basically I do. This one was a weird card. It was a, um, it's a computer disc, a um, little CD for a computer. I never did it myself, but never, never really wanted to. Like I said, this is my third and hopefully final. Depends on how far I get. Especially with my leg. I mean, the problem is I have to stand and do this, and my legs aren't as, strong, as young as they used to be. Like I said, I do this mainly because I want to teach people, show people what their cards were like in the past that they don't remember. This one is a chrome one. It's not a regular one. And here is the regular one. I mean, it's got six Hall of Famers on it. I mean, how many cards can have to say they have six Hall of Famers? Okay. I don't know how many, how much these cards are worth, but some of them are not exactly cheap. The next one, definitely cheap. I don't know how much this one, the next one is. This is a Meyer League card of Ken Hughes Jr. How the heck do you price this? I don't know. If anybody knows the price of that, let me know how much those are worth. This one is a premium stock. This is actually a mini card, but I'm putting this big so y'all can see it better. This is a six-part... Six, um, six um, Mini set. Or seven part. Not sure where the um, header is. The Griffies, Ken Sr. and Ken Jr. Again, if you're enjoying this, please subscribe and hit that subscribe button and the uh, um, like button and comment what you like about it, okay? And how and um, share it, share this. To other, those other those other people who like Ken Gilbert Jr. Sometimes my words don't come out the way they should. Sorry for those who are having hard time understanding me. I'm doing my best. This is actually a mini poster. Mm -hmm. Hey, you, you zoom in, you say I am. I like weird cards too. Like I say, any card that has Kenny Jr. on it or even his name on it comes in here. There's some nice cards here. Some not so nice, but they're part, they're still Kenny Jr. Jr. That one's a nice one. It's a die cut, I think. Where is it? I don't think so. Okay. I could be wrong.
Now that is a die cut. That's why it's called cut above. I was going to try to clear, clear these out, but they're just to the point where there's so much problem. Just ignore the prices because they're not the real. If they are, I'm happy. Some of them. Some of them not because they're bright too cheap. But if you're if you like what you see, again, sub and like and comment because basically I can use all the comments. I can't make a, a, a this thing bet this thing a little bet any better if I don't know what I'm doing wrong. And here's the regular crappy set better card. That one is a, I mean, triple play. I mean, triple play a lot better back then than they are now. At least back then they had real players, real team, players with real symbols on them. That was before Tops got greedy and wanted to take all the, um, all the, all the, um, whatever we call it. Now we're getting to some of the cards I recently got. Some of these I just got from either packs or from people sending them to me. Or, you know, or bought them like that. These two right here, these came from recent packs. They're nice ones too. Or just found out recently I had them because I've been going through my cards and some of these I didn't know I had until I actually walked, I found them as I was going through them. Sorry if the, the um, screen is wobbly, but I'm walk, I'm standing and my legs aren't as, like I said, my legs aren't as young as they used to be. See, that one's a nice one. It's Denny's. Denny's card. If you're wondering why I'm not talking enough, I'm sorry. It's hard to talk and do this and stand here and do these at the same time. I'm sorry. Mainly because a lot of times I don't know what I want to talk about anyway. Like I said, these these can't, these are new ones. I mean, there's no there's no prices to get off these because these are new ones I just put in here. There are some cards in that. This one right here is very hard. Was very hard to get. I mean, this is an insert from Pinnacle, but this is was a very hard card to find. Tombstone. Anybody wants a pizza? What you want to do soon? 
Okay, I don't have the best jokers. I'm not the best jokester. Here's another card that's really hard. Black gold leaf. Those are very hard to get. These are the last two I'm doing of get of Ken Griffin. But you should see all the blank pages. That's for future Griff cards. They're for future cards. So if you're interested in what you see, or if you're not, if you're interested, but if you like what you see, please let me know how, what you think about it, okay? And give me a a sub get, or, or share it with other people who are interested in Ken Griffin or, or baseball cards in general. Because next, I think, is Lefty Grove and Tony, I know Tony Gwynn's going to come out soon. So, like I said, I'm doing this from A to Z, and I've got a lot of G's. I'm a G-man. Okay, thank you very much. Have a nice day.